Hey everyone and welcome to another Class 66 Rocks Steel Belt review. Now before I show you this particular model I'd just like to say um, if you're interested in keeping up with all the latest news regarding um, purchases or new videos or products that I'm going to buy etc um, then feel free to follow me on Twitter um, at, Cla at Class 66 Rocks um, it's got a capital C and a capital R um, so there you can actually follow the latest goings on with my channel and um, so as soon as say like a video uploads then I'll send a tweet to my channel um, on Twitter to say that the video is now ready to be watched um, at first I didn't really want to get Twitter but then I sort of succumbed to the social networking again <laughs> a bit, I did that um, with like YouTube I wasn't going to have a YouTube channel at all then my good friend Will over at Intercity82 or IC82 for short um, encouraged me to get one and review Locos and now I just can't get enough of it so please follow me on Twitter if you can. So let's get on with the model then. So the model that we're looking at today, I'll first show you the certificate of authenticity, is a man TGX XXL. Um, it's by Atlas Editions and Oxford Diecast, but it's an official licensed and approved product by Eddie Stobart. Um, and you can buy this through the Stobart fan club catalogue if you're in the fan club um, so all these models are available in there right so let's take a look at the model then so as we can see again the box is absolutely outstanding and this time it's in a trans store logistics trailer design um, as the previous one I think was delivering sustainable distribution so this is another variation of the Stobart trailers. So as we can see, it is a 176 th scale model. It's a special edition collector's model. And round the outsides of the box, we can see that we've got the outstanding Stobart design. So now let's have a look at the top of the box. And again, you can see the Stobart design just here. Now the product inside this box is the MAN TGX XXL curd inside and um, it's called Malian and is fleet number H023. So let's get the box open and take a look at it. Now obviously as stated in previous reviews I'm not going to take it off the display stand as I don't want to damage the model yet until I can get it onto a shelf um, so it'll keep the product safe with it being in the box. So here it is the MAN TGX XXL. So let's take a look at it then so the first thing we see is it's presented on a very nice display stand um, and on the stand you can clearly see it says MAN TGX XXL Kurt inside it's called Molly Ann and fleet number H023 so let's have a look at the front of the cab first then so this is the front of the cab obviously it is a man or some people call it MAN, um, I think we've said that on Sto Eddie Stobart Trucks and Trailers on Channel 5, um, like truck manufacturer MAN, yeah, I call it MAN, some people might call it MAN, but it doesn't really matter how you pronounce it. So, as you can see, it's called Malian, and the fleet registration number is Y23WSH, and this particular model is absolutely outstanding because you've got like the Stobart design right the way around the front half of the cab section here. So now let's take a look at the side of it. So if we take a look at the side now, we can see that the Stobart Group 
website is featured but on this particular one half of the top of the cab is black whilst the other half is white um, I think that's just like a visor design for the man's I'm not too sure but if you do know please leave your comments below so as you can see it is a six wheel tractor unit and on the side here we've got the fleet number H023 and the name Molly Ann so moving along now we'll now take a look at the trailer but first if the camcorder will let me um, we can see that in between here we've got some information about the trailer and I think this is a Stovar Island trailer from what I can see just adjusting the camera and across the top here we've also got what type of trailer it is and um, which wasn't featured on the other models so as we move across now we can see it's in the Transtor logistics livery um, and I think this particular trailer is known as a step side. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm sure it is. Um, it's a tri axle trailer, as you can tell. So, now let's have a look at the back. But before we just do that, again on these models, you can see that the trailer straps are actually really well presented all the way along the bottom on either side um, so that's a really nice touch so now let's take a look at the back of the trailer right so this is the back of the trailer um, as you can see it says Eddie Stobart at the top and there it says international um, which might be what it said on the front of the trailer but it looked like Ireland on the front of the trailer um, now on the bottom here we've got the Eddie Stobart website along with the type of trailer that it is. Um, here we've got the brake lights, reversing lights and indicator light system on either side and if we just... Ah, no I might be wrong there because the indicator and the reversing light are actually here on the bottom. Um, so these might be something else, but I'm not too sure. But if you do know, please leave your comments below. And obviously under there we can see the number plate Y23WSH. So, now let's slowly turn the trailer around again. And as we can see, on this side, it is exactly the same as the other side. Again we can see the curtain straps on the bottom of the trailer just there um, which really make it such a nice model and I cannot fault this model at all um, but if you're interested in buying this model then um, not too sure whether you can still get them through Atlas Editions um, but if you are a member of the Stobart Fan Club then you can buy it through the catalogue or if not, then you could join the Stobart fan club if you wish to and buy this model off them. But that's it basically. The Oxford Diecast Man TGX XXL um, by Atlas Editions and produced for Eddie Stobart.